Hello YouTube friends, welcome to this week's video. This is an oil pastel and is created in the complementary color scheme of red and green. And I used a limited palette of oil pastels for this oil pastel painting. And as you can see, I have two greens, one light, one dark, uh, different, some, a few different shades of reds, and from, um, from a dark red to a light flashy color pink. Um, then I have the grays, blacks, browns, and white, plus a yellow for a little bit of a pop of color. So what are complementary colors? So complementary colors are colors that are, that are directly opposite each other on the color wheel, such as the red and green that I'm using here. Complementary colors make each other pop in a painting, and you can also mix complementary colors to create nice neutral colors of grays and browns. So what I'm doing here in this portrait is that I first block in some of the shadow areas, such as you know the shadow that's cast by the hair uh, next to the nose with green first, and then I simply layer different shades of reds over it. And as you can see, that creates different shades, different values of neutral colors and browns. So mixing complementary colors is a nice way to create neutrals. This oil pastel painting, the background is bright red. The skin tones are pinkish um, with neutrals created by mixing the red and greens and the morphs are also bright green. So because there are lots of bright colors, I used black for the hair to ground the piece and not overwhelm the viewer. If you are interested to learn more about color theory and using them to create colorful portraits, I'm doing a series of color choices tutorial on Patreon, where I explain the color wheel, color theory, and how to use them in paintings. A 30 minute full video tutorial of this oil pastel painting with complementary colors is included as the first tutorial in this series. If you would like to join us and learn more about colors, visit my Patreon page. Thanks for watching guys and have a wonderful week. See you next time.